Hi Rob, old comic collector, back again with another CGC submission video. Ten books going off to CGC. I'm going to use uh, quality comic books again. You might have seen them on my last unboxing vid. Did a good job for me. Got ten books going off to them. These are all economy books. Um, CGC turnaround time for economy books at the moment is 231 days, which is a little bit scary because working days wise, that's about 11 to 12 months. But uh, fingers crossed, we'll get them back before then. So we'll go through the books. I'll do my grade predictions. We'll see how we get on. You've seen this in my trade video. Amazing Spider-Man 50. Iconic cover. First appearance of the Kingpin. Round about a 3-0, I'm hoping for that one. Another Spider-Man book. And the next one along, Spider-Man 51. First cover appearance of the Kingpin. And his second appearance in the book, of course. This is a UK variant. I think we're aiming for a 4-0 on that one. We haven't got 151. You need to have two. One of each. Previous one UK. This one's a cent copy. This one's a nicer one. Of course you've got the evil black cover on this, which is tricky to get in high grade. Certainly isn't a high, high grade. I'm hoping for a 6-0 on that one. Bit of Daredevil, time well in with the Kingpin theme. Daredevil number two, second appearance of Daredevil and second appearance of Electro as well. Again, this is a lower grade, hoping for a 3-0 to that one. Does have a lot of wear down the old spine. But, uh, I think he's, I think he's a three. Let me know in the comments what you think of my grading on these, whether we're spot on or whether we're out. Fantastic Four Annual Number Six, Double Key, first appearance of Anilus, first appearance of Franklin Richards, who I'm convinced is coming to the movies. I've got a few of these. This is one of the better ones I've got. Again, these are lower to mid grade. I think this is around a 4.0. It's got a lot of lines going down it, scratches if you like, but the spine's not too bad on this square bound book. Overall, he looks pretty good. So 4-0 for that. Following on from the FF, we've got Doctor Doom. Love, love this cover. Really great Doom cover. Marvel Superheroes. Presents Doctor Doom. This is his first solo story. Also goes into his origin a little bit. Got two of these. This one I think is a 4-5. And this one I think is a 4-0. It's got a little bit more wear going down the cover on that one. Again, this is a tricky book to get in that higher grade. Square bound again. Lovely, lovely cover. Last three. Tomb of Dracula number one. Picked up one of these not long back. I'll put the uh, put the video link there. Managed to pick up another one afterwards. Seemed to be very hard to get in the UK. But this one again looks very nice. Hoping we hit a 6.5 on that one. Again, it presents really, really well. First appearance of Dracula in Marvel Comics. Is he coming to the MCU? No news yet. We shall see. You know me, I have a couple of X-Men books. X-Men number 10. Lovely Silver Age book. First appearance of Kazar. First appearance of Zabu as well. Don't forget the cat. Again. Low grade, most of these are low to mid grade. Hoping for another 3 5 in that one. And last but not least, I think we'll see this guy in the MCU when we eventually get the X Men. First appearance of Sunfire in X Men 64. 
What's the grade? What do you think? I think we're looking at a good 6.5 there. A little bit of rubbing down the side, which just might keep it around that uh, around that 6.65 grade, I think. But it looks really nice. And there we go. 10 bucks. Be winging their way off to CGC as soon as I can get them there. As soon as they go off, the sooner we get them back. We'll do an unboxing. Go through the grades. I'll let you know what I paid for them, what the costs were, uh, what we might be lucky enough to sell them for when they come back. So look out for a future video on that one. If you're not already subscribed, hit the subscribe button, hit that notification bell. You'll know when that video is going to drop. I've been the old comic collector, and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.